Have you ever wondered what causes clouds and wind? Have you ever wondered what allows a bird to glide beside them? Have you ever wondered what makes water boil? Have you ever wondered why the sound you make by blowing into a straw bugs your mother so much? Ow! What? What would I do? Well, I can't tell you why it bothers your mother, but I can tell you why it happens. It's time for the Convection Connection! Convection can be responsible for all the processes I've mentioned. Convection is the transfer of heat in fluids. A fluid is anything that flows, so gases and liquids are both fluids. And buoyancy is an object's ability to float in fluids. Let's do a simple demonstration to explain convection or heat transfer. While we are doing the demo, I want you to remember that warm fluids are more buoyant or more able to float than cold fluids which tend to sink. Let's use a glass box filled with room temperature water. When the water is completely calm, add a drop of red food coloring on the left side of the tank. Heat the water under the drop of red food coloring. The heat causes the red food coloring to rise. That is convection, or a transfer of heat. The water that is colored red is now becoming warm and therefore less dense than the water around it. Because of this change, the water that is red rises and spreads out. Convection Connection! Now let's take a blue ice cube and put it in the upper right corner of the tank. The blue from the ice cube is sinking and as the ice cube melts, it produces very cold water. This cold water is more dense or heavier than the surrounding room temperature water. Therefore, it sinks to the bottom of the tank. And if we watch closely, the red water that is rising in the left side of the tank is now being replaced by the blue water from the ice cube. Convection connection! Let's watch what happens as the blue water now becomes heated. It begins to rise. The blue water will get warm and less dense and begin its journey up in the tank. This entire process is called a convection cell. Let's review. Convection is the transfer of heat in fluids. A fluid is anything that flows. Therefore, both gases and liquids are considered fluids. Convection involves the rising of hotter, less dense fluids and the sinking of colder, more dense fluids. I hope that helps you understand convection. And remember, in the words of Carl Sagan, somewhere something incredible is waiting to be known. Keep searching.